no one knew that story. Only him and I. Right. I mean, I didn't even tell her, who lived with me. I mean, this was just... And he went out and built her and had thrown right away. <laughs> I mean, that was, that was like, you know, but that was, that was incredible to hear that one. Because like I said, I mean, no one knew that story. But there's, there's just a lot of stuff that goes on here and you just, there's a lot of history here. Mm-hmm. And a lot with, of history, yeah. With that yeah. history, there's got to be, you know, you know. Ups and downs. Yeah. And there's been <laughs> battles here. I mean, stuff that I've heard, <coughs> there's been a lot of, you know, Indians and the Mexicans battled on all this land around here. And we have grinding stones at the bottom of the hill. My and and you're the. And what? Hezekiah. My dad calls it Hezekiah. Where did that? In Indian. Oh. Yeah. And, and, and Deborah, you said that one time one of the psychics said that there was treasure on the property. Yeah. Yeah. And Black Bart. She, she hears it. Yeah. yeah. Black Bart used to roam around this area. Black Bart. Black Bart. Yeah. And he would rob stagecoaches. Wow. Yeah. So. so he yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I heard this from someone totally different that didn't have anything to do with property. He's like, oh, I heard that there's treasure here. And I'm like, what? And the psychic also told me that there's treasure on this pasture somewhere. But treasure could be anything. Like like we were talking about, it could be a doll, a treasure doll. Yeah. But Black Bart, I mean. Yeah. I mean, I know that when I lived in L.A. and somebody told me about Vasquez Rocks and Vasquez, you know, and that. I want to go up there. <laughs> and also, there, too, yeah. when you moved in here, in the barn was a pentagram. There was, yes. Yeah. That nobody can explain. When I moved in, it wasn't here. We went to do our investigation, remember that? And it was all yeah. through here. Just, just painted. And we don't know who did it. It wasn't us. Hmm. I mean, it, it was the weirdest, weirdest thing. It wasn't the kids. Did you know? Hmm. My, my daughter wouldn't come up here. She, she was, you know, and that little girl followed my daughter everywhere. Hmm. She'd go into the house. She would, I mean, she wasn't, she's not like really mean or anything, but she wanted to play. She wanted to make a friend. Yeah, I mean, imagine. I just, and the other thing the psychic said just recently, she says she's cold. She's really cold. So I guess she's, she's still in her PJs wet. Or her, her, because her, her, it was at night when she passed away. I just got choked down by that. Hmm. But yeah, um, and she, she will interact very easily with you. Very easily if you, if, you know, we did the balloon thing in Ion. Yeah. I was going to try the balloon thing. But, um. What is that, Anna? The The balloon, when you put the balloon on there, and you ask it to move it. Oh. And, and we were in the Ion Hotel, and we were in a room, and we, we, we plugged up every hole that you could imagine. We covered the, and we did this balloon, and the balloon just went everywhere. Really? It just went everywhere. It was playing. And it was weird how it went. I got pictures of that. I didn't get the video, but I got pictures. Yeah. And then during the scouting mission, someone got an EVP, electronic voice phenomenon, of something saying, I'm very cold. Oh, yeah, I yeah, that. yeah, yeah, I yeah. That. I know that Jen got some, um, something with somebody's name. Mm-hmm. And I, 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 I don't, I know it was on, I was going to pull it up on the website because she has, she still has it on her website. And, um, she got that in the little barn. The little barn to me is scary. That one? That one back there? Yeah, that one. Oh, so scared that every time you come to the lights off over here. Oh, oh out here? Yeah. Oh, I hated doing yeah, that too. Yeah, I'd leave the lights on. Yeah, I'd leave them on and forget. And, oh, <laughs> she said, go turn off the lights or she'd go turn off the water faucet or the, to the shut out here. You know, and my mom's supposed to be standing on the porch watching me. Yeah, I'll Mark there, told me about that. I'll stand down there and watch you, and then she's not there when I come out, then I'm like screaming, ah, the whole thing over there running really fast. <laughs> Mark sat there and told oh me that life. story. Oh, I, my life. I hated coming out there and turning off the lights. I would leave the lights on all night. I said, you know what? Oh, I must have fallen asleep. Sorry. I would hate to get the big, the one up top. You know, it'd be oh, like, yeah. Ugh, that was going the most. And see, all these ones are cut now. Yeah, I see. And I didn't cut them. There was five, we don't know who cut them. There was five lights on the wall. And we're, one up here. we're trying to um, wire up here, and it just it's just. No, uh, did you guys um, build the other barn also, the tent barn? The yes, up there on the side. Oh. Um, because I mean that one's really old. Oh. I don't. It's I don't, creepy. I think the, the, the hay barn. Yeah, it's, it's got some thick concrete.
concrete, yeah, so I'm not sure. Yeah, the, the, the concrete's only on the back side, there's yeah. no side of it. Yeah. But this one has concrete on the back end over here. We just moved the cows over here last night, so we got free range over here. Oh, okay, good. But, and now they'll take us down to the Wells Fargo and to the tree with the rocks. And that tree with the rocks, I would run EVPs and I would run if you had a spirit box. I mean, that one is, uh, and take pictures. When and Wells running. Fargo used to have the stagecoach go through here, right? Yeah, it was down the bottom of the hill. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Like, King right. Road would have been the... Uh, yeah, because it was, it was okay. um, Auburn Folsom was the road, okay. and this was like a, what, a finger mm -hmm. road off yeah. of it. Yeah, and some of the stones, too, you can see that the Miwok Indians yeah. grinded yeah, it. Down yeah, down you, down so down you'll see that, too, yeah, yeah, yeah. The bottle pine's not there anymore. That's why you hear the chanting, too, from the Miwok Indians, yeah. I don't know, I swear, I want to do this like I did. Yeah, it looks, I should better be your own side. I'll tell you what. I gotta tell you what, she my is a PETA, not like PETA member, and I'm not saying anything, I used to be a PETA member, I, hate to, I will admit, but them coyotes are gonna die. They ate every one of my sheep. Oh, oh man, yeah, we've got 30 oh, days man. in a row, and I've only gotten three of them. I wanna throw up, I'm sorry if everybody loves animals, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. But you have to understand what they did to my sheep oh, is yeah. really, really horrible. And they used to offer me $80 a head. They're, they're tall, but they're thin. And they're fast. But you know what? 